Hello again, Terry Bailey, Senior Minister, Indian Run Christian Church, East Canton, Ohio, continuing to kind of thread my way backwards through the book of Philippians on things that are good advice for all times, but particularly good advice for this present time. In chapter 4, we saw first that this is a wonderful time to deepen our prayer lives, and there is much to pray about, and when we do The peace that passes all understanding can become ours. Second, we saw that there is much of positive beauty and excellent worth going on all around us. If only we will open our eyes to see it. And when we do, and when we meditate on these things rather than the doom and gloom, the peace of God will also be with us. Let's back up to the third chapter now and read verses 13 to 16. Brethren, I do not regard myself as having laid hold of it yet, that is his full position in Jesus Christ, but one thing I do, forgetting what lies behind and reaching forward to what lies ahead, I press on toward the goal for the prize of the upward call of God in Christ Jesus. Let us, therefore, as many as are perfect, have this attitude, and if in anything you have a different attitude, God will reveal that also to you. However, let us keep living by that same standard to which we have attained. This is a great time to press forward in your identity of Jesus Christ. I encourage you, don't think about what you will do when these restrictions are finally lifted and the world opens back up. You can press forward today. You can put what is past behind you. You can put these current worries and troubles behind you and ask yourself this day, what can I do to be more like Jesus Christ. And when you've answered that question, do it. Forgetting what lies behind. Press forward into what we may become in Jesus Christ. For today is the best day for that action. If you would pray with me. Father, we know the glory of that identity which has been given to us in Jesus Christ. And we know that transformation into his image is possible. And we pray that today you would help us to be more like him in these present circumstances, to think as he would think, to do as he would do, to live and to love as he would live and love. For we ask this also in Jesus' name. Amen.